Yo, what up, people? I'm Don Lux, and I'm bringing you another episode of the Weapon Review Series. This week we have the M4A1, or the, basically the M4 series. Yeah, but um, this M4A1 is a pretty good weapon, actually the best in the Engineer class. Um, it does 25 damage max at close range and 14.3 at uh, longer ranges. Um, the recoil is uh, point, uh, 0 0.075 for, and to the left and 0 0.3 to the right. Uh, which basically makes it a very reasonable weapon. Recoil is easy to handle. It's actually the first gun so that's actually you have to do that when designing that. It has to be easy to start up for everyone. But uh, other news is we got Camtasia Studio 8 which basically makes editing a lot easier. So much easier I am thinking now to the co-op in split screen and this I can actually voice narrate this now so I don't have to talk live and that saves a lot of time for me. I can basically do this right now in a few minutes this can all be over. As you can see here I got the M4A1 surf star. This is actually the third I think when I got that. Yeah it's a third. Um, the accessories I use on this thing are most of the time Cobra or holographic sights. Uh, always the foregrip, bipod is actually useless on this thing. And for the other sidearms I use, no not the sidearms, the accessories I use suppressor or the flash pressure or the heavy barrel those are the main things you want to use tactical light and lace side are not that useful on these things and it makes me it's a very good weapon so yeah but the weird thing about this weapon is it just looks so much like the M16A3 even the up recoil is the same 0.26 but it's not a uh, thing because most likely people use this weapon or g 36 c or even the other weapons. You rarely see G3s but most of the time it is, the M4s. Um, you can also use the M4 with own burst fire and it makes, basically makes it the same as an um, X6, M16A4. So nothing much changes on changes on this thing it's almost a carbon copy only a few different things on it and that's it so uh, I think I don't have much to say about this gun it's a very short review I know but it's short and powerful so um, go ahead and play with your M4A1 see what you can do it's good at all ranges so you can use the conquest and even team deathmatch don't use the sniper, don't be stupid. But yeah, that's basically it for the M4A1. So I think I should uh, sign off and let the clip yeah, finish. Goodbye, peeps. I'm Don Lucked and I'm signing off.